friends of God. This is Peter and John. And Peter and John, they loved, they loved Jesus and they knew all about God. And so they were on their way to the temple. And do you know what a temple is? A temple is another word for church. No, it's a hideout. Yeah, it's an ancient word for church. You are right. It's an ancient word for church, okay? So if you hear them talk about in the Bible about a temple, they're talking about church. So I know that also means it's a hideout, too. Kind of. Yeah, well, I was going to advertise the last airbender and there's supposed to ancient temples. Okay, so look at this guy. He's laying here. Do you know what? His, he's not able to walk. His legs don't work. He can't walk. And he's sitting here and he's asking for money. And he's asking for money for food or so that he could find somewhere to sleep at night. And so he was asking Peter and John, he said, can I have some money? And Peter and John said, well, we don't have any money, but we can heal your legs. How could Peter and John do that? Because God. Points, points. Because God. Because God. So guess what? All they had to say, Peter took the man's hand, and he told him, he said, in the name of Jesus, walk. And guess what? This guy got up and walked. That is how powerful Jesus is and how powerful God is. And guess what? All of a sudden, this guy was so excited. He was jumping up and down, and he was yelling and screaming, and he was so excited. So guess what happened? All these people started coming saying, what is going on? Why are you yelling and screaming and running around? Right? And he said, Jesus healed me. And do you know what some of the people said? Who is Jesus? Some of the people did not know who Jesus was. So guess what Peter and John did then? They told them all about Jesus, and they told them all about God. And guess what? Then those people started to believe in God and Jesus too. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that awesome? So guess what? Is God pretty powerful? Yes. 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 So you know what? Remember how last night we did a verse and we sh you showed me your muscles and then we pointed to God? I've got a new verse tonight. Can we do a new one? Thumbs up or thumbs no. down? No. Okay, so you ready? First thing I need you to shake your arms up. Okay, are your arms warmed up? You feel loose? You feel ready? Okay, right in your lap. Okay, so I want you to watch me first, okay? And then we'll do it together, okay? So this one we have to do the muscles again. I know you guys can do this. So he gives power. Give the muscles. He gives power to the weak. So then you turn your muscles kind of upside down. And strength. Show me your muscles again. To the powerless. Okay, are you ready? Cash, you're all over this guy. All right, are you ready? Shake your hands up one more time. Shake them up. Okay, hands on your lap. No, gotta be ready. Okay, are you ready? He gives power. <laughs> muscles, he gives power to the weak. Turn your muscles upside down. Sad muscles. And strength to the powerless. I have a question for you. What does it mean if you're powerless? It means you have power. That means I don't have power. I might be sad. If I'm powerless, it means I might need help. Sometimes we need help, right? Yeah. Who can we ask for help?
Did you know you could whisper? You could whisper? I knew it knows. Okay, so I have a question. Next question, are you ready? Yes. Next question. Um, can I pray wherever I want to? Yes. Okay, thumbs up. You can pray. Okay, next question. I can. I can pray at the supermarket. I can pray at the swimming pool. Yeah. Or McDonald's. Yeah. Or school. Church. 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 Yeah. Or my favorite place, Super Target. Yeah. Yes.
dear God. Dear God. Thank you. Thank you. For giving me power. Thank you.